it's IBC 2022 and we're on the Marcus Broadcast stand and I'm joined by Paul Glasgow. Hello Paul. Hello Simon. So, it's been a few years, what's, what, what's, what's been happening to you since well, we last we've, met? We've been very busy, as you may notice from our booth we've rebranded, mm -hmm. um, so that reflects the broader scope of things that we're doing. Okay. We found over the last couple of years that customers have been coming to us asking for uh, bespoke integrations and some uh, basic workflow fixes. And so over the, after la for the last two years, we've worked with Fox Studios, Discovery, um, CBS in LA, um, Sinclair Broadcast Group, providing all sorts of different integrations. Mm. And so now we have a really good backlog of uh, integrations, which we're going to share with our clients here. Yeah, so that's your main focus of what you're talking about at this year's IBC? That's one focus, I think, more for the enterprise side of the customers. Mm -hmm. And we have more initiatives, um, such as providing some of our productivity products as on a SaaS basis. Mm -hmm. And so uh, products such as project parking and workspace backup, you can now uh, effectively use for a short term for a single production, um, which provides lots of flexibility. And it, mm -hmm. it maps very nicely onto what Avid are doing. Yeah, and what type of clients are you expecting or hoping to see at the show this year? We, it's strange, we see some of the biggest enterprise clients, they'll be here alongside small post houses which are looking at you know, extra resilience against uh, ransomware attacks and things like that. Mm, okay. So we have a very broad scope of visitors. Yeah, and you've got a free download, I believe? Yeah, we have. So if anybody wants to do um, uh, analytics on Avid storage in particular, we have a free download which you can download from our website um, which will allow you to look at the system and analyze it over a couple of months and see what the trends are, do you need to expand, could you clean it up, all those sorts of things, and that's free. Okay, so just going back to over the last two years, what's sort of like been the most noticeable um, technology that you've been seeing? Yeah, well, I, I think obviously cloud is a really important um, driver for the industry, but not all of the major networks want to have all of their eggs in one cloud basket. Mm. So for example, we've been working with a, an enterprise client in the US who want to integrate AWS, a production workflow, into Avid in Azure. Okay. And we've been able to do it in such a way that we've been able to reduce the um, egress charges from AWS by 90%, which actually transforms the business, mm. business side completely. Okay. Oh, and just as a final thing, what sort of sets Marquis apart from maybe your competitors? How do you do things differently that make people come to you? Well, I, I think a lot of people appreciate the quality of our products. They're very reliable and, and um, you know, we have very few problems with our, with our products. But I think at the top end is our domain expertise, it's our knowledge, our ability to use a library of components to bring together and, and produce very powerful mm. integrations very quickly. Yeah. Okay, so where can people find out more? Well, marcusbroadcast.com is a really good place to go. Yeah, and if you're at IBC, Hall 7. Hall 7 B50. Hall 7 B50. Thanks, yeah, Sam. Thanks, thanks to people. So for all the solutions, do check out that website. And uh, for everything else we're doing at IBC, check out kitplus.com.